is just a little quick informational video of something I wanted to share with you. I get asked an awful lot about weed fabric. Customers um, are always looking for what, what's that silver bullet to be able to keep the weeds from coming up in an established landscape or even a new landscape. And so um, weed fabric always comes up in the discussion and over and over again, I have to give my weed fabric speech about why I really don't recommend it. And today I came across a site of some old established plants that have been in a very heavy weed fabric, more of like a geotextile type of a fabric like you would put on um, underneath pavers or underneath a road base. And this, this landscape's been in for over 20 years and uh, I wanna just show you some of the damage that's happening as a, a result of long-term uh, coverage with weed fabric. And one of the things that happens is that whenever you have heavy weed fabric, like what this geotextile is here, you can see it's a woven, um, a, a heavy black type of a matting. And two, a couple different things here. You can see this root is coming up on top of this fabric. And the reason is uh, people don't think about trees needing oxygen. They always think just carbon dioxide, but the roots need oxygen. And so they wanna come up to the surface to get the best ratio of um, air to water. And so you can see on this tree, these roots have come up to the surface and they've continued to grow in a circle here. And I think that it's a result of the fabric being underneath there. Um, when you're looking at the soil, you can see it's it's a really nice soil here, but if you dig down in, and if you can see here, I've hit the weed fabric. What that means is that over time, with the application of mulch, the dropping of these needles, and the, um, the breakdown of plants over time, it's turned into a really nice loam soil on top of this fabric. But what it's not doing now is preventing weeds. The only thing that's preventing weeds in this area is shade. Um, and then actually one more thing too that I want to mention is that because this hillside is steep, the problem that happens when you've got weed fabric, especially on a hillside, is that we can't keep mulch on it. And it mulch just slides right back down over top of this fabric over time. So whenever I tell people that it's a short-term gain, long-term loss, this is exactly what I mean. We've got trees that um, should be reaching their prime right now and they should be looking incredible and instead they have symptoms of stress all up and down the tree. The, with the main reason being, in my opinion, the weed fabric, keeping them from being able to get the right ratio of air and water to their roots. And then uh, the second thing is that with all of this, you still aren't preventing the weeds because we've got a nice coverage of soil on top of the fabric. And so the weeds are gonna grow right back on top of that. Long story short, don't use weed fabric. Short-term gain, long-term loss.